Hi, and welcome back to another video feature of the Immersive Worlds Handbook. Today I'm looking at the AC Hotel by Marriott, uh, which is in Portland, Oregon. I recently took a trip to the city and I stayed here and I was pretty impressed with the design and the comfort and so I wanted to give you a quick video tour. So as I do in some of these videos, I'll show you, show you the main features um, of the hotel room and you get a sense of what it's like. And I'll talk a little bit in this video about minimalism and simplicity. Um, if you saw my video on the Delano, uh, which is adjacent or connected to the Mandalay Bay in Las Vegas, I think it's another point of reference here and maybe what we're seeing um, in the movement of uh, hotels into a new uh, design era. So let's go around the hotel and we're just looking at um, the hotel room. We're just looking at the um, artwork here. And um, if you saw my video on the Delano, it's a much starker room, uh, certainly. You could say that it um, has none of the touches you see here at the AC. And I think one of the reasons for that is when you come to Portland, you expect probably a lot of what we're seeing here, right? You expect these sort of wood tones here with the pergola. You expect maybe more these sort of colors in terms of the uh, the color palette as opposed to what we saw at the Delano, which had that stark whiteness. Um, maybe more reminiscent of a Miami South Beach um, uh, type of aesthetic. One of the things you get here is the, uh, the TV, and of course every room has a TV in every hotel. Uh, but you know, one of the things that struck me about this is when I first um, checked in, they had this video loop playing with people from the world of fashion and design. Um, and this is just the, uh, the screen that you get when you first turn on the TV. But what they're talking about here is um, the sensibility. Um, remember him from uh, uh, America's Next Top Model, right? The great photographer. And he was talking about in this video that for him, um, a hotel has to have minimalism and simplicity because as a creative person, he wants to be able to um, you know, have creative inspirations. And this actually was kind of revolutionary when I thought about this. If you think about a themed hotel, say in Las Vegas or any city, but Vegas comes to mind, um, in a sense you are potentially overwhelmed by the theme, by the narrative that's being played out. Whereas in a hotel like this, if I follow um, his argument here, um, you know, you're allowed essentially to um, import your own personality or thoughts or creativity into the space. And it's something to think about when we study minimalistic design and what it uh, entails. Um, and so that's one thing I think that could be interesting as more hotels take the approach of the AC in terms of looking at um, simplicity and minimalism. And I have to say this, this is pretty revolutionary for me. It has a, uh, a Netflix button actually that you can click on. This is one of these things that is really a simple thing, but I think it, it's amazing for those of us that love Netflix. Anyway, you don't have to see that. Um, but one of the cool things is if you click on um, the apps button on the remote, it has the traditional TV guide. But look, so it has the, you have the ability here then to watch um, selections from YouTube, Crackle, Netflix, Pandora, and so forth. I haven't tried this, but let's give it a go. I just saw this. This is a Bluetooth uh, feature. Okay, so it doesn't do um, what I thought was going to be cool. I guess I could play iTunes on here. But what I wanted to do was to um, sync up my photos or videos and be able to watch those on the screen. But apparently I can't do that. So um, still a cool feature. Get out of there. Um, yeah, but in any case, you know, as I said, it's um, more and more, I think when you think about where hotels are going, this kind of smart component, you see this in a lot of Vegas hotels, is gonna be really key because people love their media, they love um, the internet, they love uh, you know apps and YouTube and so forth. So I think it's an opportunity to really uh, capitalize on that in terms of the guests. But let us continue walking around and um, just show you the design so there isn't a ton to see. It's a pretty small room. See the bathroom here? Um, yep, yeah, pretty simplistic. Again, you see the um, the choice of colors here and some of the fixtures. Simplicity, minimalism with the um, the sink, and I, I have to say I like the the soap. <laughs> the fact that it's a uh, a ball, I, just, I thought was kind of cool. A nice little touch there. 
on even the toilet, right? Very modern, minimalistic design to it. And you see the rest of the room. Yeah, so in any case, um, you get a little feel of the, um, the AC Hotel here by Marriott. And uh, this is their one in Portland. I haven't checked out um, the other uh, AC hotels. This is my first one. I, I did want to read to you. Maybe we'll go back to this shot of the art. And let me just quickly read this to you. I thought it was kind of interesting. Um, this is from the Marriott's website. This is the this sort of vision behind their hotels. Um, each of our spaces is built from the ground up with a visionary's spirit and a designer's eye. It is stylish yet efficient, alluring, but purposeful. Every detail is considered to provide you the beautiful essentials. A new way to hotel. Um, we focus on the essentials of a beautiful stay and create an experience unlike any other. Um, they talk about their continental breakfast that has a European inspiration. Um, room service has been replaced with the flexibility of a quick snack or even tapas plate. And you'll see that downstairs there's a, a cafe and a restaurant and a bar. Our bar attenders are true urban spirits who will share the unique buzz of the city and all it has to offer. It's an experience that has been designed to give you the essentials. And um, goes on to talk about the um, experience and so forth. And so now maybe I'll take you um, downstairs. I'll show you some of the still shots of the lobby and you get a sense of, of what it looks like down there. Okay, you see the exterior of the AC Hotel in Portland, um, very unopposing and minimalistic. And uh, as we walk into the lobby area proper, you see some of the design approaches. Everything has been carefully thought out here in terms of the books, the fixtures, um, the artwork that's been chosen. Just really classy, minimalistic, sparse, but interesting and aesthetically focused uh, choice here. A very composed scene here, whether we realize it or not. And I have to say overall that as you enter into the lobby, it really mimics some of the uh, choices they've made in terms of the design within the room. And for me, it placed me in a, in a place of comfort and tranquility. There is nothing over the top here, and I think that's exactly the point. So it's very much fitting with what I described to you in terms of that uh, video loop that is uh, playing on the screen. So a lot to think about today here in Portland at the AC Hotel in downtown Portland, thinking about hotel design and many other issues. I hope you enjoyed the video feature today here looking at the AC Hotel by Marriott here in Portland, Oregon. Uh, please come back for additional video features of the Immersive World's Handbook.